Giovanni couldn't stay away and the two soon fell in love, but Beatrice never let him kiss or even touch her. Meanwhile, a professor of Giovanni's warned him that Rappaccini would do anything in the name of science, including exposing his own daughter to poison until she became poisonous too. He gave Giovanni a small silver bottle filled with an antidote that could counteract the poison. Giovanni was unwilling to believe his professor until he saw his own breath kill a spider. Furious that Beatrice had contaminated him, he ran into the garden and confronted her. She insisted that her father's science was to blame and that all she ever wanted was to love him. In response, Giovanni suggested they drink from the bottle together and be cured. Agreeing to try it, Beatrice took a sip. Just then, Rappaccini came into the garden. Beatrice demanded to know how he could inflict such doom on his own child, and he said he did it to make her strong. I would fain have been loved, not feared, Beatrice cried. Saying goodbye to Giovanni, she fell to the ground, dead. The remedy countered the poison in her veins, but in the process, it killed Beatrice as well.